Russia and China are seriously considering a project to install a nuclear reactor on the moon in the next decade. The official media in Moscow quoted the head of the Russian Space Corporation as saying, Yuri Borisov, CEO of Roscosmos, Russia's state space corporation, responsible for space flights, cosmonautics programs, and aerospace research, said such a mission will have to be automated with the necessary technological solutions almost ready for Today it. Today we are seriously considering a project to deliver to the moon and mount a power reactor there jointly with our Chinese partners somewhere between 2033 and 2035, Volwi Borisov said, at the World Youth Festival being held at the Sirius Federal Territory. Earlier in March 2021, Roscosmos and the China National Space Administration signed a memorandum of mutual understanding on behalf of their governments on cooperation in creating the International Lunar Research Station. Under the project, China plans to send three missions, Chang'e 6, Chang'e 7, and Chang'e 8. The first lunar missions would test key technology to create a roadmap for building a robotic base for experiments and research that could be operated remotely. The first lunar mission is scheduled for 2026 and the project should be wrapped up in 2028. However, Borisov stressed on the necessity of overcoming the limitations of solar panels, citing their inadequacy in meeting the electricity demands of future lunar settlements. Instead, the deployment of nuclear power emerges as a promising solution to fuel these extraterrestrial habitats, ensuring continuous and reliable energy supply. Acknowledging the complexities involved in establishing a power unit on the lunar surface, Borisov highlighted the importance of automating the process to mitigate risks associated with human presence during the initial stages. In addition to the lunar power plant, Borisov discussed Russia's plans for developing a nuclear-powered cargo spaceship, referred to as a space tugboat. This vessel, equipped with a nuclear reactor and high-power turbines, aims to facilitate large cargo transportation between orbits and address various critical space missions. Russian officials have spoken before of ambitious plans to one day mine on the moon, but the Russian space program has suffered a series of setbacks in recent years. Its first moon mission in 47 years failed last year after Russia's Luna 25 spacecraft spun out of control and crashed. Moscow has said it will launch further lunar missions and then explore the possibility of a joint Russian-China crewed mission and even a lunar base. China said last month it aimed to put the first Chinese astronaut on the moon before 2030. Russian President Vladimir Putin last month dismissed a warning by the United States that Moscow planned to put nuclear weapons in space as false, saying it was a ploy to draw Russia into arms negotiations on the West's terms.